For this week's episode, our good friends at Google have set us a super insane challenge in celebration of the Google Pixel 3. Disgraceful. I'm the plug, done now. So, um, do you watch PAQ? Man walks into a pub with a lump of tarmac under his arm. He says, I have two pints, please. One for me and one for the road. PAQ presents Pixel or It Didn't Happen. So, welcome back to PAQ. For those of you who don't know who we are, we are a sick fashion show based on YouTube, but we are touching every part of the world, different continents, all that good stuff. And you know what? To get around the world, you need transport. So, sometimes we're in a pedlo. He got stung by a wasp. Sometimes we're in a dinghy. Man does not know how to do this. But more time, just take the yacht from out back, you know what I'm saying? How much? 450 mil. These jokes are horrible. I don't get it. Like Oz. I don't get it. You're in oh, like. Forget it. Forget it, man. First comment on every episode wins a Kyra tote bag. So for this week's episode, our good friends at Google have set us a super insane challenge in celebration of the Google Pixel 3. The Google Pixel 3 is all about elevating the everyday and they do this with a ton of new features. So what we're gonna be doing for this challenge is getting a white worker's jacket, white worker's trousers, customizing it, whatever you want to do, free roam, elevating it from something normal to something spectacular. And then at the end, we're going to be debuting this at our own runway at the Google Curiosity Rooms in front of 300 PAQ fans. Say 300. Spartans! Spartans! <laughs> so runway walks, I've done like three or four runways in my life. Jeez, I'm scared! I'm so, I'm yeah. so there are no boundaries to what we can do. We just have to start with this outfit. This is one of the challenges that shows the creativity from all of us. You know yeah. What I'm saying? There's so many different things we could do. I mean, embroidery, painting, yeah. patches. Garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you guys stay in tune with this episode because we are going to be giving one new lucky people at home the opportunity to win a Google Pixel 3. So my favourite feature on this is the Google Lens. So you take a picture of something and it'll tell you what it is. So to prove that I'm not hiding anything. Yes, oh, that's it has sick. Got the Adidas original so, in white. So we will be using the Google Pixel 3 all the way through this episode so you lot can see us using all the features and kind of get used to it. Customising fits, elevating the everyday, being judged, 300 people, dem tins, short phrases. Ready? Yeah, sick. Boom, let's go. All right, sick, bye. So Google Pixel 3 episode. Making the everyday extraordinary. We've all been given a plain white jacket, a plain white tee, and plain white trousers, and we have to elevate them from something so normal and basic into something phenomenal. I made the fit black. If it's all white, of course I'm gonna dye it. And I realise you can actually dye using vegetables. You know, lucky for you guys, this episode I'm gonna show you how I can elevate something I want to take this more high fashion. My idea, I'm thinking of turning a jacket into like, maybe like a smock. I feel like once I've got my rolls of fabric sorted, that's when everything's going to fall into place. I'm going to go out of Brooklyn, find some fabrics. Ooh, it's like a deck chair. And then I'm going to head over to Benji, who's going to do all my customization for me. It's time to start dyeing. I've heard you're an expert in dyeing clothes, but not just dyeing clothes, but naturally dyeing clothes. Hi, my name's Jordan. Um, I run a project called Salt Textiles. For blue, um, we can use some plant dyes and um, we'll use red cabbage and change the colour of it, change the pH. Whenever I buy like bottles of water, it's very mm -hmm. important you check the pH level, man. Yeah. That is lovely. Ooh, another one. My corner shop sells 8.2, so I can hook you up if you need some yeah, alkaline I'd love water. A, love an alkaline hookup. <laughs> I'm the plug, done though. So first of all, my influence actually came from one time when I stumbled into Dover Street. I came across this Comme des Garçons jacket. I was like, wow, this is incredible. Instead of comic book uh, sketches, I'm going to use this amazing collage by uh, Joe Webb. So not only am I printing the collage onto the garment, I'm adding another layer of texture to it. It's very like 
Dexter if he was a, a mum. The reason why I'm in the studio in Tottenham is because I'm going to be doing some DIY. I'm going to be involved in a lot of paint splatter. How do I say I wanted to do something that represents me and is a bit crazy. I don't want to give a lot away, but what I will say is... If that makes sense to you, it makes sense to you. If it doesn't, then I just made a damn fool up myself. So unfortunately, you guys aren't going to be able to see the full process of the garment being made. So I'm wearing this right now because at the moment, you guys are in my humble abode. And you know, this is my everyday. I'm trying to show you my everyday I wake up. I'm going to take you through my routines, you know, whether that be my skincare, how to brush your teeth if you're not sure how to do that yet. Brush that. I actually didn't just sort out my shoes today before I actually get on with the day, but I'm basically going to take you through my everyday. I think Shaq will end up doing something very, is that a new word, avant-garde? Yeah, I'm, I'm dying some clothes. Oh, nice! Watch his one documentary. I've decided it's time for me to take a little practice. Now let me try to get the middle of his head. OK, that was nowhere near the middle of his head. The next part of the process is you're going to make the dye matter. So you're just going to chop this up like you would if you were cooking at home. Treat this up fruit ninja. Should I, should I try that? So I've been told to catapult straight off. Here we go. I hate cabbage. What's the, what's the green cabbage? Lettuce. I like lettuce. Ooh green cabbage is cabbage. Lettuce is lettuce. Pop, pop. I want to see if the Google Lens can actually pick up uh, a shredded cabbage. Wait. Oh my god, I actually got it. I got you some clothes, because I'll see you naked. So after looking around for a while, there is a lot of amazing fabrics in here. But I think I'm going to go quite plain and bold instead by having the main panel out of like quite a substantial, like either this or this red down here, and it'll all tie together. Cool, so this has been soaked in a mordant, so it's now ready to be dyed. So maybe let's start with the sleeves. So, um, do you watch PAQ? So now my hands are washed. I will splash my face with some water, you know, get it uh, lubricated up. <laughs> Just been fabric shopping, we've got the red wool, have a navy wool. Hey, I'm Benny Andale. I'm from London, and I'm a menswear designer. A almost like pinstripey navy and red. Sweet. And then you just want to put a bit of force on it. Some exfoliator, you know, to uh, clear out the pores. On the trousers, maybe like a like an external pocket out of like one colour. Then same as like the cuffs as well. And you just got to moisturise everything into the skin. You know, make sure you don't miss any areas there. Cool, see. So what, do you want the charge to taper or like the length of like change and stuff? Um, taper a little bit. Yeah. Because I've not got the the nicest legs in the world. I've got little skinny <laughs> chicken legs. The neck as well. People always forget about the neck, bro. It's the neck and the face you've got to pay attention to. Yeah, so I'm actually going to like cut part of this, or like pull that part of this jacket off here. <laughs> Watch this one documentary. How would you like to fasten it? Supreme Fireman Jacket. Showing pictures that match. There we go. Then after the tea, you got a brush, your tongue as well. Something about it's kind of bringing me like British Airways uniforms. <laughs> yeah, this is actually mad technical. I'm not gonna lie, this is a lot more technical than I thought it would be. <laughs> so now I actually need to get into my clothes that are ready for the streets. You get me? This is just, you know, my Zone 9 Flex. Maybe pop to the shop, or if I pop to, uh, you know, Fez or Marrakesh. I have 16 Air Force Ones here, then I also have a shooting pair of white Air Forces, which are at the office. That toe cap is not okay. Disgraceful. It's not calling it uniform. It's, just, <laughs> it's a cool fashion jacket for the kids. <laughs> and they always have to point that way, and that's not right, because that needs to go, like, wait, wrong way. Yo, Elias part two, bro. What? Beam. So next bit, we're going to make the dye. So Sick. we're going to have to put this red cabbage in, and then we're going to change the pH okay. using this. So this is going to go that colour here. You can see it's already starting to go a bit. Yeah. And then... Oh, wow, that's crazy. Yeah, it's good, right? This is actually Elias part two. 
man's on the way to collect my final customized piece. I'm so excited, yet very nervous at the same time. I'm always trying to avoid the people that are stopping you as well on the leaflet thing. Nah, skirt. Oh my god. I think that I smell it. Yeah, that, that, <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, are the clothes gonna smell like that? No, because you will wash it out. Oh. I'm gonna let you walk around. Oh, it's my life. Like that. <laughs> Cabbage fart. <laughs> it's interesting. That's like a, a cauldron. Yeah, it's oh. gone a bit green. We should put the jacket on you to like see yeah. how it fits in you. Um, okay. Let me get some water. Ow. You alright? That is hot. <laughs> Yo. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to let my clothes boil overnight. Then we've got to get the embroidery done on it. Can't lie, I'm actually quite shook about how this is going to turn out. Especially because how complicated it is and there's so many different layers and like, you know, I haven't actually seen it. The dyeing is done. I'm super gassed about it, but I still feel like it's not elevated enough. I've, it's been a while since I've incorporated like, you know, an illustration or a poem that I've done onto an actual garment. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I've gotta to move on to part three. That is adding the straps and making the last minute customizations. Living with my wounds by Shaquille Aaron Keith. Day after day, night after night, that painful feeling always returns. It's something not even a mother's kiss can heal. Scars left by people who were fake but the pain they left me with was real. And now the emotions remain concealed. Gashes from being stabbed in the back, grazes on my knees from falling head over heels, bruises on my torso from all the low blows I've taken. But these marks are hidden under my hoodie, so I don't expect anyone to ask me how it feels. Who's really to blame? Them or me? The caterpillar stays protected in his cocoon, a lesson I should have learned. But now I suffer living with my wounds. So I just finished design process with Benny. It was slightly tragic on my part. So we're approaching the door where I'm gonna pick up my final customized ting. Did I have fun? Hell yeah. Yo, I'm bare nervous, bare excited. It should be pretty sweet. Dying done, cutting done. I've now written my poem on my illustration. What's next is to get it embroidered and I can't wait to see it tomorrow at the live event. It's gonna be sick. I don't mind not winning. I don't mind not winning. It's not even for me. It's not about taking the dub. I just wanted to walk away with some cool clothes that's got my face on it. That's that's literally my goal. Thank you guys so much for coming down. Thank you to Google as well. <laughs> the launch of the Google Pixel 3, they've made this possible for you guys to be here for a live outro. We've never done anything like this, so our hearts are just like I know. <laughs> So anyway, what is PAQ without a judge? We have a presenter and she is amazing and she'll be our guest judge for tonight. So everybody welcome on Fen. Hello, 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 hello. Hey, so guys, why am I here tonight? That's a good question. So Google Pixel 3, in celebration of the launch, they set us a challenge. It's all about elevating the everyday to something extraordinary. So they've given us a plain white fit. I'm talking a white jacket, white trousers, and we've got to elevate it, customize it, and then debut it in front of all of you beautiful people here. So it's gonna be hot. You might as well show one of the features as well. You know, everyone loves a selfie. They've got this sick, wide angle. Uh, Yo, you love selfies. I was going to say. Have you seen this guy's Instagram oh, lately? Bare uh, selfies, man. Yeah, yeah. Me love selfies. We should have been. Let's, yeah, let's, let's have a, a wide angle selfie, see if we can fit You guys everyone. ready? Oh, no. Ready? Yo, yo. Put your hands yeah. up, guys. You guys see. ready? Cheese! What? Crazy. <laughs> man, love it. It's a deck. Yeah. You're up. Go for it. So what do you think he's going to do? Uh, I think the audience can tell. What, what, do, you lot, what do you lot think Dex is going to do? <laughs> That's it. Navy, Navy and black. Yeah, Navy and black. black. Yeah. Oh, man. It's like a pantomime. I wasn't expecting to go out <laughs> No, I know. It's kind of mad. It's yeah. ready. You ready? Let's get it. Yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm in, like, direct eye line, so I'm prepping up.
So what I did is first off, yes, I dyed it black. Yeah? I ended up going to a studio, kind of got up close and personal with a mannequin. I had a little target practice with a slingshot to do the paint. Decided to add straps because I wanted to create a stray jacket. I like it, and I love the walk as well. Who was up for the walk? The walk was sick. Thank you. Um... I love it. I think it's it's very Dexter. You can still see that it's the original jacket. I like how the dye hasn't taken to the stitching as well. It's very like bondagey, gothy but with like the <laughs> as well. I think it reminded me of like one of my favorite designers, which is Alexander McQueen. Really embodied that, the darkness, you know, the straps, the black. I don't think no one gave credit to the crepes fam. Them are, those are actually <laughs> hard fam. Hot those are hard. Rocks. Danny, you are up. Sweet. Does Danny take as long to get changed? He probably oh. went to the pub. Can't even lie bro. <laughs> <laughs> he <probably> dipped. <laughs> Sometimes less is more. So yeah. I thought I'll keep it white. And then what I'll do is just add block colors. So it's white, navy, and red, very like regal. And then I had an old fireman's jacket with these kind of clasps on. And I thought for the next accessory or customization challenge, I need to add these on. It's a good look for you. I like the color combination, the textures are working. Can I have a feel? Feels pretty nice. Play from teal. Let's have a look at the hood up. It's a little, it's a little bit simple. I love the fact that you kept it simple. It's very, very, very clean. I think this is beautiful, bro. Yeah, I think you look like a sailor mixed in with Little Red Riding Hood. <laughs> but, you know, it's working. I think it's sick. First of all, I just want to say, that walk was epic, fam. You know, the way you kept it so minimal is so amazing. Can I just see how you just, just on class for one, just so I can see how it, Oh, that's sick. Elliot, <laughs> you are up. <laughs> Let's go. So what do you think he's going to do? I feel like this one, he was really excited. He was talking about how he feels like he's gone out of his comfort zone. I feel like he's going to do something that I don't think we expect. So I'm excited to see his stuff, bro. The sun goes down, down to the ground. We bring a torch to town. Asking how we like the way that you walk around. A different day, but the night is now. Show them how. Hold the crown in a golden gown. The door is open now. You might be an earthquake. My tectonic place to make you move. On the ground we groove. Hit the sun like rocket boom. To the moon we skip past. Said you went for light to Mars. Going quick, fast, and slower. Cause we sick with stars. How did you do this? I'm out of breath, man. <sighs> I haven't actually hit gym in time. Cool. So yeah, there's some sick designers that are doing like whole prints. I mean like Calvin collaborating with Andy, Com as well with the Basquiat. So I decided to work with a guy called Joe Webb. Sick collage guy. Honestly, I want all of his stuff up in my yard. It's like a collage of buildings and there's a little boy putting like building blocks like in the middle of it. When you're a kid, the world's your playground. So then we printed it onto some fabric and then they were individually cut out and sewn together. Mate, you've gone all out in the attention to detail, like to the extreme. I'm pretty impressed. This is flames. And the fact that you use the artist as well, and the message behind his artwork as well, I think is very beautiful. I love it. I think it's amazing. The colour scheme's lovely as well. It's almost like a sunset, sunrisey kind of pinky, orangey, fade to purple. Obviously, white Air Forces, of course. Out of all the things I think I've ever seen you like customise, I think this is definitely one of your finest pieces. Although, I mean, I remember like before you did say I was your favourite artist, but at this uh, point you didn't do my stuff. <laughs> but it's alright. Yeah, it's all love, day, it's you know what I'm saying? Shaq, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, son. Go on. What do you think he's going to do? I think it'll be sick if he includes his own work like he does. Yeah. Um, but it'll be interesting. I mean, he always goes hard when it comes to the custom challenges. Edgy, I think he's ready. <laughs> Quick question, who are you kissing in the audience? Oh, it's my mum. Oh. Cheese! What's awesome love, Gail? <laughs> Woo! Hey, Gail. I feel like we should get her on stage. Go on, group oh. bug boys. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, oh. 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 Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Gail. Thank you so much. Um, talk us through, how have you made 
the ordinary and turned it into something more extraordinary. So for this one, I decided to dye my clothes, but I did that using red cabbage, which is a bit mad. Put red cabbage in water, you boil it, add bicarbonate soda, left it to soak overnight. And then in terms of the actual design, like on the actual jacket itself, so I have like a, I have a poetry book where I do illustrations and I write poems. And I wrote this poem called Living With My Wounds, which was a very personal one to me. And that's why like, I decided to put myself with my gold locks as embroidery on the front of the jacket. Um, on the back has got the poetry embroidered as well. Turn around. Yeah, it's like, like really subtle, you know? Yeah, I love the gold with the hair. I Thank think you. that's epic. Super fresh. Dex, what do you think? I'm not gonna lie, bro. I think this is super clean. The fact that you actually took time out to tie-dye as well. Beautiful, I love the color. I just, I'm stunned. That is so familiar to me, and it all makes sense now. Me and Shaq lived together. You had that in a bowl in the cooker, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> so that, cause like, we just had this mysterious big, like, cauldron, and it just had something, like, bright blue in it, but I had no idea it was this jacket. I think it's sick, man. Like, the way you cut off the collar, the little detail there, the way you kind of cut that section at the bottom of the jacket, the shorts. I feel like you've been banging out shorts, but it's the wrong season, I stay you. But it's hard, it's hard still. Um, the only guy that, you know, embroidered himself onto his jacket and it's still bang. So, you know, killed it, man. I think it's hard. I now have to make a decision. I'm gonna do pros and cons. Dex, we're gonna go on to your outfit first. I love this because you, you completely stay true to you, but then you add these details that you don't expect. Like those shoes, you're gonna knock somebody out with those shoes. <laughs> oh, like, yeah. uh, Danny, again, another epic outfit, completely different. Elias, I love this. I feel like this outfit is you, but like we've never seen it before. It looks a little bit messy. I think that that's kind of it, <laughs> right? Shaq, like I said, I love the gold, I love the embroidery, the poem, everything. It feels like it's you. So I have to make a decision. Uh, I think the winner is... Oh, man. <laughs> oh, Anna. Shaq. Yeah! <laughs> I mean that every... <laughs> Thank you. you did it. <laughs> so big love to Google Pixel 3 for making this possible. Honestly, this was incredible. They asked us to take something that's everyday and turn it into something extraordinary. And big love to Fen as well. Cheers. Cheers. Yay. Yay. Join us Killed it. Week. Love you. Right. We out.